so induced current not has its own direction it depends on the direction of battery current or main current so if we put this value in the formula of induced emf according to the faraday concept faraday law the induced emf is equal to minus d phi upon dt having n turns so n is multiplied here e is induced emf this sign tells its opposing nature now here we know that n phi n phi is equal to li so e is equal to minus n phi is li so d upon dt li here lf is constant or self inductance so magnitude of induced emf that is e is equal to negative l d i upon dt here the term d i upon dt is called rate of change of current or time rate of change of current when this term when this di upon dt is negative then e is positive it means when current is falling this back emf produces a current in the same direction when di upon dt is positive then e is negative it means that back emf tries to oppose the growing current so if we assume di upon dt as 1 ampere per second and emf is as 1 volt then the self inductance becomes 1 henry it means when induced emf has magnitude 1 volt and the rate of growing or rate of falling or rate of change of current is 1 ampere per second then the self inductance offered by the coil is 1 henry it proves that self inductance is the tendency of the coil which tries to maintain the current which tries to maintain the magnetic flux linked with the coil just like inertia in the mechanics when this magnetic flux tries to increase then a current is set up in the coil which tries to oppose or tries to decrease this main current so it flows in opposite direction when this flux decreases again this induced emf come into play and form a current in the same direction to maintain its magnitude 